Hello, it's your boy Davidoff. I, was, I, was, I wasn't going to react to this game to be honest, I don't, I don't really mind really. It's a Nations League third place game and I'm just like, do we need this? But um, I don't really mind if we win or not, but it's a penalty shootout and I like penalty shootouts, so uh, let's see how it goes. We lose most of them, but um, we did win one last year, so let's see if we can do one here. We actually did score and it was just love for VAR as well, VR decision. England fans are not happy, uh, which is fair enough, but to be honest it was the right decision, it was a foul. It's just that I find it funny how, like, for years, fans, players, pundits have been complaining about referee decisions, about offside goals that are not offside, about stupid fouls being given for, for blatant dives, etc. And the moment we get something new to help us with that stuff, people suddenly have a complaint when it goes against them. Like, people are always going to complain. You just, you, just can't, you just can't get everyone happy. You just People always find a reason to complain. If you take VR away right now, the moment the ref makes a mistake, people start complaining again. So, you know, you just can't win with people, to be honest. But I think it was the right decision, though. I think it was a foul by Wilson, so... Alright, so, um... Penalty shootouts. Um, I really don't mind the wins, but... I would like to see us win a penalty shootout, so... I do mind the wins, actually, technically. I mind now. Like, this whole time, this whole two hours of football, I didn't care. Now I care. So, there we go, just because it's penalties. Alright, first up is Harry Maguire. Is he good at pens? It's good pen. Good pen, 1 0. England fans behind the goal, pretty funny. Damn it, top corner. Top corner, 1 1. Barkley, come on. Cheeky, cheeky. <laughs> if he missed that, that would you look stupid, but. All right, nice penalty. Jack is up next, Arsenal player. Apparently he's leaving as well. Don't know if that's true though. It's just, I haven't seen any official reports. But anyway, hopefully he misses this. That'd be nice. Pretty sure I missed one as well in a shootout like a few years ago in the tournament. I think I remember from the Euros, I think. 2-2. Two -two. Why are players so bothered about putting the ball outside the sport? Is, does, it, does it like make a difference? Genuine question. Oh, good pen. Like, surely the middle is better. I don't know, whatever. Alright. Just hoping for them to miss one, to be honest. Because we're doing alright so far. Casual pen from that Swiss player. And he just... Perfect into the... Perfect into the corner. Damn it. 3-3. Free -free. I think he's a new guy as well, he just made his debut, I think, for Switzerland. Raheem Sterling. He's missed a bunch of chances today. Like, he, he had a few chances that he should have scored, really, but... Please don't miss this one. <laughs> please. Uh no, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. He's been missing all day today. That's why I was, I was very worried, but... That was a good pen. No one's missing! Someone miss, please! I can't handle this. If this one is missed, and we score, then we win, so... Let's just hope they miss. Probably gonna score. He looks confident. Go on, Jordan! Save it! Save it, mate! Oh. He went the right way, he was around the corner though. As if Pickford is taking one. He better not miss, seriously. Like, he best not miss. Is he good at pens? I remember Joe Hart was, but that's, that's years ago. Is he, is he good at pens? He could definitely kick a ball, but... <laughs> he's usually, uh, usually for long distances, not for... Uh, 12 yards. Ah, oh, nice pen! It's sudden death now, basically. If they miss this, then we won. Come on. It was so slow as well. So it was so soft. And Pickford didn't... Oh, damn it. 5-5. Five, five. Sudden death. Eric Dyer, The hero of, uh, of the World Cup against Colombia. That was our best win in the World Cup, in my opinion. 
That was a that was an amazing night. Go on. Nice. Please miss the next one, Switzerland. Third place for England. Um, it's not great, but I'll take it. You know, based on what's happened. I'll, at least we won a game. That's great. We didn't really win the game, but we won on penalties. So, you know, it's nice to see us win penalty shootouts at least. You know, it's nice to see us win that. <laughs> I, I do care now. I care now because it's a penalty shootout. But I honestly did not care in the first two hours. But there we go. There's a win for us. Bronze medals. Yay. We need to improve though. Like, we have weaknesses in our defensive midfield. We need to build on that ASAP. You yeah, try out different players because we are not good enough for a tournament at the moment. Um, we need to do better. A year to the Euros as well, so we really need to improve by then. Because um, we could potentially do something because it's, it's taking place partly in England. It's taking place all over Europe, but the semis and the final are in England, so we need to try and like get to the semis and play at home potentially. But um, that's all ifs and buts, but we, we need to try and like improve ASAP because at the moment we're not good enough. Um, I think that showed against Holland. So, yeah, there we go then. Third place. Uh, at least we end on a win. So, yeah, that's the end of the season now for football. Actually, no, there's one more game. The final. I'll be reacting to that, so that's, that'll be the next video. And uh, hopefully that's a good game as well. Um, I don't mind who wins that game, honestly. Um, so we'll see what happens. Either Holland win or Ronaldo wins. I love Ronaldo, so... I mean, I don't like Portugal, but I love Ronaldo, so, you know, I don't really mind who wins that final. But yeah, there we go, that's it. This is your boy Davidoff. Please like, share, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a good day, and see ya.